So there is this horror game called Creta. And I saw this horror game on this uh, browser known as Opera GX. Don't worry, I'm not sponsored by the way. And I thought to myself, this is interesting. I did not think that there would be a game, a horror game, an indie horror game looking game that would be on Opera GX. So I thought, okay, I'm, I, I could play this. Now I've had the idea for a few weeks now, probably a month at this point, and now that it's Halloween and pretty much almost at the end of Halloween, I thought, you know what, I'm gonna go ahead and actually play this horror game for the day of Halloween, 31st of October, and it might not be a good game, it might be a great horror game, like, who knows? But since I've been playing a lot of Silent Hill 2 Remake recently and I've on a little bit tired of the game. Not really, but uh, because I've had mostly Silent Hill 2 videos coming out, I wanted something to come out on the 31st of October. And I thought this could be a good selection, maybe? So here is the game, Creta. Start. Okay. Wait. Hang on. How do I. How do I. We should probably look at the tutorial first. Uh, enter? Uh... Oh. Um, okay. Use Waz to move. Hold... Okay, you can look around by clicking on the screen. Um... Um... Okay. I don't like how you have to, like, hold down your click, but, uh... Okie dokie, so you should be more comfortable, you can look around with the... Wait, what? Oh! Well, that's alright then. Get near a wall, when the prompt appears, apply a light stick. What prompt? Um... Oh! Ah, oh, okay, that's my stamina. What? That? Setting up. Oh, okay, so you've got to wait until it... Okay. While in darkness, toggle your flashlight with Raklicor. Okie dokie. So I'm guessing we're going to be putting more... Yeah, okay. Why are you going to wait for the... I mean, it makes sense, kind of-ish, sort of. So how... Wait, wait do I have to put... Uh, glow sticks around... Everywhere? Like, everywhere, everywhere, where, where, whoa, whoa. Okay, um, so a bunch of uh, collision issues, but that's fine. So, wait, hang, wait. This, I don't know why, but this looks a bit different. This is okay. So I kind of get the tutorial now. Can I like exit the tutorial? Oh, so they are just sort of lighting my way in a sort of way. Okay, can I escape? Okay. So that goes back to the title screen? Yes, it does. Okay, so start get. Actually, to be fair, this sort of environment in the background reminds me of I'm Scared A Lot. Which is actually pretty good, and I might try and, like, remake I'm Scared somewhere at some time in the future, maybe. But, uh, okay, start game. I'm kind of interested... Let me guess. We are just immediately in the game. Okay, so, actually, to be fair, it does have that I'm scared feeling. Let me guess. Actually, do I... For some reason, the uh, collisions are very, very sticking. Uh, so, can I, can I, like, a uh, flashlight? Can I, can I get you? Can I, can, okay, do I have to click on you? No? Okay, fine. Um, guess I won't be... I uh, need my flashlight? Well, it seems like I can't pick anything up. So, okay, let's just uh, move on. Door. Hello? Um. And there's a space. Wait, actually, have I been using the wrong. Um, the space? It's. I thought space was just to put down the glow sticks, not. Okay. Well. 
I mean, I've got my flashlight, but I can't seem to turn it on right now. Can I open up this? I can't. Okay. So, flashlight. Fla flash. Fla right click. I seem to not have my flashlight. Is there like a... Is there still a... No, it's gone. So I should be able to turn on my flashlight. Like, why are you doing that? Anyway, we went down this uh, corridor. Great. I will admit, I've not played an indie horror game for ages. And it kind of feels weird, but also... Refreshing to be playing... Uh Um Okay. Okay, so now I can switch it on and off. I've I've Okie dokie, thank you very much. Then again it Then again I sort of would probably maybe do the same thing in my horror game as well and sort of control the flashlight from the game and not give the player much control over the flashlight. I, I would sort of do the same thing. So you know what? I'm not really gonna. I'm not gonna critique it that way. So this game is fine. Actually, is this gonna mess up the game if I do F F11? Okay. <laughs> I mean, uh, it did make the game kind of ish, sort of full screen, but not the full screen that I was expecting. But okay. Let's just uh, keep on going, shall we? I don't even know what this is even about. I basically just went into this blind, which, to be fair, I do a lot with a lot of indie horror games, just going to a blind, because I just like to... Um... Oh, yeah, 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 I forgot about these. Do I actually need these for something? Well, um, technically, I don't really need my flashlight if I'm putting down these light candle things. But what exactly am I actually doing? So I'm inside of this, um... Oh, okay, yeah. I lost my stamina. Whoopsie daisies. I'm inside of this... Right, yeah, I just... I just... I, I, just, I put that down, of course. So what about over here, then, huh? Is there gonna be something down here? Like, waiting to, like... Eat me alive, or... Because so far, I'm just going into the crypt. The thick of it. And I'm... Doesn't, I don't seem to be able to... This this feels like a maze. And it's not an amazing... Um... Okay, so I... Wait, I... Wait, wait, wait. Well, I got my wish, everyone. I got my... I... I got my wish, everyone. I got my wish. So, wait. Is there... What's the light stuff for, then? You know what? I'm gonna set... That did not do anything. <laughs> okay. Well, I've, I've, oh my god. Okay, well, I'm trapped. I'm trapped. I'm gonna die. Come set me free from my existence. Don't tell me you're always stuck as well. You know what? I completely understand. It's a hard life, isn't it? Once you're stuck, you just can't move on. It's so hard to just move, isn't it? When you're so stuck in one place. I know exactly how you feel. Your head is like twitching. You just, you, you can't wrap your head around it. You cannot. So you try your hardest, but you just, you struggle to. You cannot fathom what's right in front of you. So you're stuck in one place and you're twisting it around. I feel you, buddy, I feel you.
Um, I don't suppose I can like get past you, can I? I could try. I'm gonna die though. Oh. Oh. I've. I've got health. Actually, technically, my battery is going down. So apparently, my battery is my 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 my, my battery is my health. Because that makes sense. Don't tell me that. Are you actually? How are you getting so easily? Okay, you are jittering. You 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 are jittering out of control. You're going faster and faster. This is the true horror of this guy. <laughs> this is the true horror. The absolute true horror. So happy Halloween, everybody. <laughs> right, you, you, you're 100% going to, like, kill me or kill my battery, at least. Yeah. Your record. Battery life zero opt. Opt? Optional? Optimum? Optimus? Prime? Well, you know what? Enter? Um. Uh, exit not found. Oh, but the. What? 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 what uh, Well, alright then. So, okay, I picked up all of this. Okay, so camera, tripod, uh, the duct tape for the lights. So, I, okay, I don't know what this is even meant to be. Like, what, what am I actually meant to be doing? Like, am I meant to be, like, exploring? Did I go the wrong way? Do I, am, was I meant to go this way? Apparently not. What about this way then? Can I finally go this way? So, wait, hang on. Do I just go into it? Oh, I... Okay, so what about going into this door then? So why is it just this door? Hmm? Why? I mean, you can't even tell me, oh, it's locked or it's blocked or anything like that. You don't even tell me anything. Like, why? Why only this door, huh? Why? Okay, what am I... Actually, you know what? I'm going to see if I can find, like, a description. So, description. Made for Game Maker Italia's... Terror October... Okay. Developed to Game Maker Studio. Nice. And heavily inspired by a movie called... Navitum Record. There's some differences. There's an in-game tutorial and uh, still controls uh, move around, arrow keys look around, you can left click and drag the more you're near the screen, the okay. C? C key? I did not get to that part. Uh, toggle crouching, toggle flashlight, space interact, and here's some tips. Play the game in a dark environment, um, well, uh, it's a little bit of a issue, but I tried. Use headphones and take advantage of the 3D audio, uh-huh. Use light sticks to draw your path. Sometimes turning off your flashlight could be useful. Don't let it deceive you, this game can be f If the game can be finished... How do I finish the game? More games from my madness. Wait, hey. Wait. Develop... No wonder why it's in the same style as I'm scared, because it's made by the same person! You know what, genuinely, I had no idea about that, I had no idea it was made by the same person. Okay, so, Fortress, oh yeah, we're, oh yeah, we've already played Fortress before. Got, get some robot. Pillage? Discomfort? I don't think I've played Discomfort. Viv, nothing... I kind of want to play Discomfort now. I mean, whilst Kreta is somewhat interesting, 
I don't know why, it doesn't feel like there's much to do in it, just, you know, explore around, uh, find a monster, put light sticks around, I, I, like, even though that is kind of creepy, like, if you had more atmosphere in it, I'd say there would be more, but because there's not much atmosphere in it, it just like, I don't know, it feels like it's lacking, so we will also play dis Discomfort. My madness works. So, move, look, okay, space interact, so the same as the other one, so, um, play. Oh, okay, this is way, way more into the style of I'm scared now. <laughs> and this one actually feels like it's got a bit more atmosphere in it. So, wait, space, it, this is the exit, I don't need it. Okay, I don't know why, but that just reminds me of Spongebob. Like, I don't need it. I don't need it. I need it. Anyway. Uh, okay, so... This... Whoa. Why, hello there, beautiful. Can we look out the window? Oh, oh, oh. Okay. It's still turned on. Okay. Interesting. Honestly, I'm liking this a bit better than Kreta. Maybe Kreta's like an experimental one, or maybe like one of his first ones. I don't know. It's a candle already used, but still useful. Uh, book, book. Nope. Okay. Um, door open. Okay, Lockheed. Aha, kitchen. Candle, already used, but still. I mean, if if it's still useful, then why don't you fucking pick it up? Actually, what happens if I actually use my mouse? Um, wait. Uh, I can't even. So the only way to look around is to use arrow keys. Okie dokie, okie dokie. Dropping board. The apple is still fresh. Okay. Window. Yeah, I see you. I see you plain as day. Um, that's... Okay. Okay. As the game's title suggests, uh, I do feel a bit discomforted. <laughs> so that was the clock. Okay. What the hell is this? Apparently there's nothing, it's not giving me anything. Exit, fine, 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 okay. Wait, I mean, where was that? Um. So, it doesn't seem to be on this side, okay. But wait, whereabouts? Ah, <gasps> clock, here it is. So, 12 o'clock. Okay. Fantastic. Don't tell me that he's... You, you, you still... You're not moving. Oh, do I need, do I need to be like doing, uh... Fucking, oh my fucking god. Why the fuck did that scare me? Why did that scare me? Of all the things to scare me, that scared me, huh? So wait, what is this? Oh, obviously it's this. Okay, great. That's, um... T -t Tomato ketchup, 100%. It's a knife, tentative... No, 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 no. We've already established that it's not... He's dead, I need to know what happened. Well, it's definitely tomato ketchup. It's not, it's not blood by any means. Computer. Oh, wow. Oh, whoa. Well, <laughs> Got an interactive mouse. I mean, mouses are interactive, but still. I I hear nothing from Sarah to Ranger. But what the hell, Phil? Have you got nuts? Why are told me everything? Where the hell? Where the hell are you? Also, please stop saying these things. Far. Uh, I oh, I'm heading right there. Wait for me. Well, I, and don't do anything stupid. Okay. Barely games. Ooh, star. 
from the creators of Firmamus Quest? For nameless, for for, for for I have no idea. Uh, this this text is really hard to read. And planet shape his star breeze, a new pl platforming. I suppose, I suppose it is for Mamus then maybe pl pl platforming challenge that you don't want to miss. Starbreeze is now available in stores near you. Win a copy of Starbreeze by sending an email to Belly. Okay. You should give it a try. I bought a copy for the NES because the Sega one doesn't look so good. It's crazy how many things you can do with a simple story. I've, I'd really like to. M I'd really like to have met the story writer. Answer only if you buy it. Interesting. I'd like to play that game. Need net. Need.net warning. If you stop reading this, you <laughs> if you stop reading this, you will die. <laughs> In 1982, a boy named Calvin was strangled to death in front of his PC. After his death, his email address started sending a photo to everyone. If you don't resend this email to five other people, Calvin, Calvin will appear in your dreams and kill you. Well, dang. Now that you've seen this picture, it's too late to step back. Resend this or you will die a painful death. Oh, and there was something wrong in the last email. It has to be yours. Okay, super... Farm. Okay, super farmer. Our new... has arrived to our stores. Buy Neza... By clicking on the link below. Discover all of our new... Okay. There, there is no link. There is no link below. Uh, a new, uh, new trend. Have you tried summoning the annoying woman? It is said that she will answer to one... What the... What the fuck? It is said... Okay. Maybe I should... Um... 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 I gotta admit, I heard something. I don't like that I... Fucking just fucking. Why did that scare me as well? What the f. What? Ooh. I like how you can rotate it in the. Why did I not try that out with the key? That's interesting. Okay. Well, um. What's happening in the. Don't tell me that. They've moved. <gasps> you are. You are definitely, 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 definitely. Close. Okay. 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 Well. Um. Okay. Well. Um. 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 I'm gonna go back onto the computer because um, it's interesting shit to read. So where about supposed to be? Um. Right. New trend. So it is said that she will answer to one question of yours, but you have to stay alive in the process. The rules are simple. Draw on the ground in your home the symbol. Uh, the symbol above. Place three candles on every ellipse you've drawn. Cut your hairs and put them over the. S okay. That last part is a bit tricky though, so I'll be straight. You have to cut off the. In wait, 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 wait. Cut off the. of someone that you know. Then make sure to be alone in your home. Turn on the candles and wait for her to do anything you want, but avoid sipping and keep. When she'll come, she'll ask. The. She'll ask the figure to you. <laughs> okay? Give it to her and ask your question to receive an answer. Touching her or failing the instructions above could lead to your death, so watch out. Sarah? Let me know when you will stop being this weird. <laughs> oh, I still have chills thinking about what you said last time we met. I know you're joking, but please don't even consider. Don't, please don't ever consider doing such things. I said I'm going to avoid all of those need dot mails. They're starting to creep me out. By the way, did you cut your hair? Here's our last batch of ghost photos. 
Not gonna lie, the yeah, that it's so weird, like like I don't know, compressed or sort of posterized. I think I think that's the name of it. P posterizing the image like that, having like different colors and like pixelated, it does make it so much more creepier. And that's um. Get more on it on net. I'd rather not, mate. You've been visited. Watch out from these two. You've been visited by these two persons yesterday night. You don't know about that, but it is really something. TV won't talk about it, but apparently it is terrorizing a lot of people nowadays. Being visited does no harm at all, but avoid encountering it when you are alone in the streets. It could be fatal. Well... Um, I suppose. Gotta fix the sim. Oh! Don't tell me that we could've. Oh my fucking. Oh my f. Well, okay. I literally thought that there was someone here already. Oh my god. Right, we have another candle, great. You're close, right? You're fucking gone. Of course you're fucking gone. Why why would why would you not be gone, huh? Why why would you not be gone? Why would you not? Okay. Well Great. I've done that now. So Oh, and you're there. Great. Hi. Hi. Yeah. I'm so, I'm so glad that you could make it here. So now what? I need something to turn on these. Oh. Like a lighter or... Wait. Oh, wait, hang on. Do, do I... Not, not, not this. I have to do something else first. Okay, yeah, fair enough. Oh, my God. Picked up scissors. Oh, my God. The... I... Hate everything about this. So how close are you now? You're still kind of close, but... This... Um... I'm... Um... Wait, hang on. No? Um... Oh! Oh, light... Yeah, of course, lighter. I just didn't know that the lighter was... Oh, great. Okay. Lit the candles using the... Yep, yeah, okay. You're still there? Fantastic. Put my hairs in the symbol? Okay. And you're even closer. Great. Now I have to wait. I should find a way to lose time. Uh... Well, I mean, um... Oh, maybe this. Oh, yeah. Okay. Dot matrix of stereo sound. <gasps> this is amazing, yo. This is amazing. Um, door. <laughs> answer to me. Yeah, answer to me as well. Safe is locked. Wait. Oh. Oh my actual. You are joking. <laughs> this is great, though. This is great. Locked. 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 Okay. So bed. Okay, so nothing with the bed. Okay, so bathroom. Sing is missing his valve. Well, we're back here. Can I not go through the? Okay. Safe. Can I? Can I not like unlock the safe? No. Something underneath the bed. No. I don't. This isn't really much, is it? Then, if you can't do anything. Wait, unless there's something here. The screws are sturdy. I don't... Oh! Okay! <laughs> so... Okay. Valve. Okay. Fix the sink. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh. Bloody key. 
Oh! Hi. Okay, it answers me even more. Okay, so locked. Um. Ah! Screwdriver, right, okay, yep. Yeah. Nice, okay. Nice. Nice. Okay. So, wait, what? Did. Wait, what? Oh! Oh, oh! The eggs yeah, just appeared out of nowhere. Okay. Not nice. So. Of course you're in here. Uh. <gasps> you. Well, um, that was the experience. Now, to be fair, I don't even know if it has like multiple endings or not, like two endings or something. Like, was I supposed to do something better in order to do it right? Was I supposed to like, I don't know, uh, get the knife to like kill them or something? I don't know. Or maybe I was supposed to exit. Maybe. But you know, everybody, hope you have all enjoyed. And, I, you know, I was expecting this video to be about, I don't know, 10 minutes long. <laughs> like, not even that long. But you know what? Half an hour. Holy shit. That was, uh, I'll be honest, that was de definitely better than Creta. Because Creta, Creta just felt like, I don't know, it felt like your first project. And, of course, like, your first project isn't going to be great. And... I just feel like Greta was lacking so much. Now granted, that was an Opera GX horror game and my first time ever playing this sort of games and it was, to be fair, it was a different experience. I'll give it that. And, you know, playing with um, arrow keys instead of using your mouse to look around, it, like, there's just something so creepy about that. It's just that sort of limitation of playing it just it makes it so much more constrained, so much more limiting. And when it comes to horror games, it's like really, really good. But when you have like uh, full on looking around with your mouse, it I don't know why. It kind of sometimes takes away from the horror feeling because you can just like wiggle your mouse very, very fast. And I don't know. It just I think I do prefer. Sometimes, not all the time, but sometimes, uh, using arrow keys when looking around in a first-person horror game. It's just, especially one in that sort of style, it's just so good. Anyway, everybody, hope you have all enjoyed. If you did, did enjoy it, then please do leave a like down below, and I shall see you guys next time. Peace out, everybody.